What's up, everybody? Anthony from the Meeple People. We also have Rob. Yeah. Joe, who just broke something. <laughs> What's going on, guys? <laughs> Why do you have to make a mess, Joe? And, oh. and Dan's here. Hi, guys. All right, and we are opening up a second box of Warhammer Age of Sigmar Champions. We opened up a box in Gen Con. That was our first video. This is our second video. Basically, we're just going to show you the, um, the uh, back four cards which are your pack foil your uncommon the crazy common the crazy uncommon and your 24 packs let's get to it you know what you know what? we're gonna be we're gonna be gross about this one because i don't, I don't know I just want to get done with. all right let's go 24 packs let's open a foil archaeon and be happy for us. For, for our foil divine blast pretty good blessing then we have carry on feast we have the hell knight which is pretty cool champion and our rare yes i needed that blood fury warmonger wrathmonger the oh, yeah. card who does its job it's so good yeah i almost topped the first ever constructed tournament but i got dealt 18 damage in one turn and it was a bad thing our foil Foil bat swarm. Yeah, that's never gonna Seems scan. Like that's <laughs> never gonna scan. Bane of everyone's existence. Tides of death. Really good uncommon blessing. Iridescent horror. He's in the starter deck, Sorry. so he can go away. And our rare. Oh, Celestial fate. Go. Still need a foil one of these to blind everybody. Need a regular. Well, you know what? We can trade. There oh, you go. There you go, Ralph. One. This is what friends. You can have two, depending on what you, you could have. possibly have two now. Our foil is. Arachnorok Spider, Uncommon Sneaky Grot Shaman, The Common, Gore Grunta Boss, and our rare Deathly Resolve. This can be played while con this can be played while controlling a spell, so it's pretty cheap. Yeah. Rotate your highlighted spells too. So it's really good. I have three of them. I have a four one. Really? Oh, that was yeah. the card you were telling me about, right? Yeah. That card's yeah. pretty um, crazy. Especially because it can be played over spells. Seems good. Our foil, Skeleton Legion. Stacking in the undead, by the way. Yep. Well, there is. Well, Sneaky Grot Shaman, Deathless Thralls, and our rare is Archeon. Nope, it is Black Hunger. Increase the damage and healing from the highlight from highlighted and mordant units by two, aka all of them. That's pretty good. That's good. Good pretty good. Pretty good. Let's get some. Um, let's get some uh, order stuff. That'd be nice, right? Order. Yeah, that's when I have the most order stuff when I need destruction. Oh, so that's weird. I mean, if we're placing orders, wouldn't mind a, you know, meatball. Rejoice and Slaughter. Cursling. I need a Cursling. Lord Veritant and our rare Bloody Vampire Queen. She's pretty good. Actually, I needed that one. That's my place out right there. She's in, uh, what do you call it? Uh, Starter. These are yeah. some dark foils. Mm -hmm. Well, some of the cards actually have black on them. Yeah. Those are the champions from like the. No, some though, some right? of the no days. some of the cards oh. in the back do. Foil gaze of Mork. Oh, I think um, Schmidt needed that, so I might need to talk to him about that. Gaze of Mork. Armies of the dead. Abhorrent Ghoul King, and our rare, frenzied devotion. Two damage to yourself. Trigger any last stand effects highlighted units without Real removing good. them. Real good. Well, good in your deck, probably. Um, only like two of my units have last stand abilities. It's like, maybe as a one of, just to yeah, like... No, I run yeah, I'm running mono red chaos, I don't run any wizards in the deck. Every don't, everyone that played me at Gen Con was like, what are you doing? Foil <laughs> Righteousness, Berserker Rage, Liberator Prime, and our rare, Celestial Prosecutor. Corners two to three, increase damage done to your opponent from highlighted units, the one from left and right. Corner four, damage to your opponent. That's pretty good. Get another coil of blood from the blood god. I love that card. I would love that. I would love that. Again. I actually want some of my I want to foil out as much of my deck as possible, but I want a when lot don't of that you <laughs> That's very true. Reckless inspiration. Swift judgment. Frenzied war chanter and our rare. Foot of Gork. Remove a highlighted unit. Rotate this unit. Ro rotate units next to the highlighted champion 
one step forwards without triggering their effects, that's pretty good. That's Sp really good. So it's good if you have like X's and you need to like... Well, no, it's... it's yeah, you're no, right you're, you're, it's you're, right in front yeah, of you. Yeah, you're rotating your opponents. Oh, your opponents? Without too? triggering their effects. Oh, that's really good. So you could like rotate them off in a yeah. turn. Yeah, cast damage. Stuff. That's pretty good. Foil Hungry fell bats. It's a good time. Divine Blast. Pretty good. Straightforward blessing. Oh, is that one of the black and white ones you're talking about? Gaunt, Gaunt Summoner and our rare. Infernal Gateway. Good times. Card's really good. Remove a highlighted enemy unit. Deploy up to two demon units from your deck onto the highlighted ally champions. Shuffle the deck after searching. That's pretty good. There's one of, if people are wondering if this game has tutors, there's one of them. There's a few. Yeah. A lot of spells. That's pretty good. Grab two units. That's pretty good. Arfoil. Blood Feast. Not Blood for the Blood God, but Blood Feast. Then we have War Boss Recruiter, who's in the starter deck. Oh, sorry, those are rare. Skull Thorn, Skull Throne, which I already have foil. And our rare is Skull Reaper Icon Bearer. When any of your allies remove a unit, restart out a highlighted unit. Last and two damage to your opponent. Skull Throne's another cool one if you get foil. Yeah, because it looks like a, we can see the grading. Yeah, and it's so it's so nice. You just see his skull. Oh, the gold looks like the Hellfire coming up behind it. It's pretty sweet. Our foil. Foil Chaos Rune Blade, that's really that's nice. Cool. Mm, that's pretty. The Royal Hunt. Oh, did it again. Crypt Hunter, Courtier. And our rare is Cunning Grot Shaman. I needed another one of him to trade off. Oh, he's not Oh, it, he's not unique. That's really cool. Didn't realize that. It just looks like he's he should be. <laughs> it's very powerful artwork. Very powerful ability. Mm -hmm. foil meat shield grots then we have strength from victory spirit torment and our rare crowded wolf chariot it's good. can only be deployed on a, onto a stack of two rend damage to your opponent oh god it does eight, eight at the end damage. wow if you guys don't know what rend is that's unblockable Yep, piercing. Yep. Really we cannot. Really any, good. Any, any damage reduction does not count against that. That is a really good card. Holy shit. Oh, stacking. Foil. Mm -hmm. Turmoil of Souls. It's very cool looking. We have Lord Aquilor. We have Grot Shaman Spider Rider and our rare. Uh, Griff yes. Charger Pack. Heroic Act. We start a highlighted Stormcast unit. The, rotate this step one step forward. It's yeah. really crazy. Literal only order card. <laughs> oh, you might have some. Oh, looks like he's opening all the trade bait for your up. Uh... Our foil, supernatural horror. Then we have unrivaled battle unit. Then we have protector prime, and our rare aspect of the seed. This is like my eighth aspect of the seed. Yeah. No, it's very good, but you don't need more than one because it's. 11 points. Yep. <laughs> I always find it weird that some of them are more than 10 points and they don't say you need on them. Mm -hmm. Even though your cap is 20. Yeah. Like, Foil. Reckless Juggernaut. Oh, yeah. Prophet of the Wah! Wah! Brought Shaman Spider Rider and our rare. Foot of Gork. Someone needs to make a um, open art where it has Wah on it and just has Wario on it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Our foil, Shrieking Terrorgeist, then we have Outrageous Carnage, then we have Riptooth Megaboss, I love that artwork, and then our rare, Gaze of Corn. trigger the current ref effect on a highlighted unit and then remove it. Nice. Riptooth Megaboss, sounds like something out of Borderlands. I don't know if you know how the orcs are, but well, the orcs are basically border <laughs> live the life of Borderlands. Yeah, in space. In space. Except for Psychic. Oh yeah? You know what's Psychic? Me. You know why? Foil Archeon. Well, Loudmouth Mega Boss, there he is again. Well, how's that for the case? Lord Relictor. <laughs> Skeleton Champion. And then... 
Call of War. Hold on, back up. Did you say that orcs are psychic? Orcs are psychic, yeah. Yeah, 40k. In 40k, they're psychic. They have crazy abilities. Did you know that everything that they paint red is automatically faster than anything else? I knew that, but I thought that was just the pure belief that they, they think the color red goes No, faster. it's because yeah, it does. it is. Because they're psychic. <laughs> they count that as a psychic. Chaos problem. champion foil. I don't know if you knew this, but the one drop, the one cost um, guys in this game are insane if you want to just do Blessing Rush. Pennant of Sigamon, Protector Prime, and our rare, Stand Fast. People are complaining about this card, going, I don't understand why this is a rare. Well, it's a little different, because... What do it do? It Highlighted units cannot rotate. Only on the turn that it's played, which means if you know they're going to rotate units on that next turn, that's good. But it doesn't prevent you from rotating units on the next no. turn. So like if you're playing a deck that rotates unit, your opponent's units a lot? No, it only it only affects yours. No, I'm saying if you're playing a deck that rotates your opponent's units a lot, and if, if they play that, yeah. then you can't rotate their stuff. Uh-huh. Rob just spilled birch beer everywhere, and he's yep. just standing in circles. <laughs> it was actually pretty entertaining to watch that. Here, let's just, I'm not gonna lie. I'll show you guys the mess. Lies. There it is. <laughs> Way to go, Rob. At least this this material beads. Sorry, All right, so our foil. Oh, foil Archeon! Why? The birch beer blessed us. <laughs> Look at that foil. The foil's insane. That's gonna go right next to. Now this is gonna go in between my Founders Edition and my regular one. Fantastic. Thanks, Rob. Then we have Sp- Spell Leader Curse. We have Skulking Necromancer and our rare. His frenzy var guys doesn't really matter. Joe, are you still picking up cards from your mess? Yep. yep. Joe's still cleaning his mess while Rob cleans the mess that he started. Everything's a mess right here. This isn't good. When there is Maybe we'll get another good foil right, right now. Nope, we didn't. We got Paladin Protector foil. Then we have Reaping Karen Wraith, which is okay. Might of Gork and our rare. Slashing Screamer. This card is so good. I run three of them in my deck, even though I don't try and run demons. Damage to your opponent, it's X2 and then 3. One damage to yourself, heroic act, one damage to yourself, and remove a highlighted unit. Seems good. All right, every time they play anything, I'm just like, I'll take a damage. <laughs> one damage instead of one, taking one the damage, take, uh, 8 to 10 that you could possibly mm-hmm. from a huge... Anything. The only thing is that it's units and not spell, and this I haven't really seen much spell removal in the game. Foil, we have Sneaky Grot Shaman, then we have a Exalted Deathbringer, we also have a Spirit Torment, and then our rare is Heartless Corgrass, also another card I run in my deck. Gotta treat it like an RD, it's a pure RDW deck, Red Deck Wings. Maybe I'll do a little deck profile in the near future. Storm Strike Fulimator, Asheron Soul Render, Knight Azeros and our rare, Mega Boss on More Crusha. Last pack. Let's see what we got. Hopefully it's something good. You know what, we're gonna take the rare, we're gonna put it right here. The foil rare. The fo- it's gonna be a foil rare, I'm predicting it. All right, we have Cruising for a Bruising, Gaunt Summoner, our rare, Cowardly Grots, and our foil rare, because I'm predicting it. I lied to you guys, I am so sorry. It's a call from of the grave, but on the bright side, if we can find it amongst these peasant cards, there it is right there. This is all that matters. Look at this. Good. Mm-mm-mm. Just so you guys can read the ability, it's pretty insane, hence why he costs 13 points. Mm-mm. When this champion removes a highlighted unit, aka any of them, Draw one card. When this champion removes a highlighted spell, move one spell card from your discard pile to your hand. Boy! By the way, RIP Man of Confidence. Nope, we're not talking about magic cards. <laughs> Get that out of there, Joe. But thank you for watching. That card's dead. Expect, <laughs> expect new videos on Warhammer, Champion, Warhammer Champions in the very near future. I'm Anthony. Uh, I'm Jose. It's not Jose, it's Joe. I'm Dan. And Dan's here. Thanks for watching. See you soon.